Glad you could join us on 101 Business. I'm Vivian Akinyosui. On the show today, we have another interesting guest. She is the COO and Executive Director of One for One Worldwide Nigeria Limited. She will be answering quite a lot of questions on, the, on our minds. And just before we go on to meet her, let's take a look at these messages. When you start out in a business of your own, how do you know you're heading in the right direction? Those who have gone well ahead of us are here to talk to us about it. And one of them is Mrs. Bumi Oke. She's going to answer quite a lot of questions here. And just before we do that, let's take a look at this profile. Now, Bumi is in charge. Permit me to call you by your first name, madam. Please go ahead. She is in charge of the day-to-day -day operations of 141 worldwide nigeria she is a fellow of the advertising practitioners council of nigeria apcon and an executive board member of the association of advertising agencies of nigeria triple a n with over 23 years experience in the marketing communications industry viewers today would like to know a lot about the marketing strategies for business growth and she started her career in grant advertising in 1986 and how old was i then oh my gosh and later on moved to ltc j what does this mean Matt? well those are in our industry these are names that just like with law firms or accounting firms they have global presence they are international they have reputation and they have standards we should understand why we are in business in the first instance if you're in business just for money it's unlikely you're going to get anywhere you want to go in life. Whether it's selling granuts or having a corporate structure, love what you do. The second thing is that it's not everybody that is caught out to be an entrepreneur, but everybody can learn business skills. There's a difference. That was the message taking I the went headache, home with Taking the day. headaches mm. of entrepreneuring ideas mm. is very different from running a business. Hmm. Now, you could, some people are great entrepreneurs, but they're not great business runners. Some people are great business runners, but they're not great entrepreneurs. Sorry, Mrs. Okay. Let's take this one, <laughs> one by, by one. A business leader, there are some things you may not want to do. Like this morning, I'm sure you didn't particularly want to get up and do this show. But business calls, you have got your bills running. And so I also at a point, I thought, oh, I have made a commitment. I need to be here. Whether I'm being paid or not, a commitment is as good as a sign check. And that is the difference in business. <laughs> Can we just put our hands together? <laughs> that exactly is what you were saying to me. I mean, what I found very interesting about 101 Business is that sometimes I have a joke I crack. I say, Ecology 101, <laughs> which is the study of husband matters. <laughs> because people ask me sometimes, that, oh, are you are still married? Are you have a business? You're running your blah. I say, yes, I've been married for 22 years, going to 23 years. I thank God for that. But I tell them I've still got a long way to go because we pray to God for a long life, which means you still want to get to 50. <laughs> so the point I'm saying is that it means that we now have to go to maybe from 101 to 102. So there are different courses at different times in life. And that's mm -hmm. the point we're bringing out. You know? Thank you. So having said that, as a young manager, I'd always told myself, and it was my husband that reminded me, I said, I will always want to work in an international agency as, a plus, as, a, as a, an individual. I don't want a mushroom agency because... I like talking, but I don't want to waste my time talking. It's obvious. And I found out that <laughs> if I talk to the people that don't understand what I'm saying, they will like me, they will smile at me, but they won't pay my bills. So there's no point operating there. <laughs> Very good. Is that your business vision or your uh, family vision? No. My own. <laughs> your own vision? Yes. <laughs> Well, thank you for that question. You know, I believe mean, sense of humor is very important in this business. Otherwise, you grow old before your time. <laughs> you know, um, one thing I would say is that, you know, success needs perseverance and conviction. There will be times your spouse may agree with you, and there will be times your spouse may not agree with you. But what makes it successful is that you are successful. Any decision you decide to say, oh, I don't agree with you on this. And the person says, oh, why not? And you prove that. You know, it's good. Then it's successful. You know, it's just like taking management decisions. You know, what makes people successful is that they said, okay, they took some good decisions that worked well. But I always tell people that it's not how you start, it's how you end. Mm -hmm. 